The student roster report is a highly customizable list of the students in a class that you can customize with all kinds of different data. It can be very useful in a wide variety of scenarios. To access it, we click Reports and then Student Roster. By default, the student roster simply shows a list of all of your students with a note column. However, we can change this report to show a wide variety of things. First of all, we can change the name of the report at the top. This will change the title of the report at the top of the page once you run the report. Next, we can select which classes we want to run the report for. Then we can select how students are sorted by the same options that are available in other reports. Finally, we can adjust what the columns in the report show. We can also change the name of the column on the report by typing in this box. This will then change the name of the column once you run the report. We can add columns such as what course they're in, the student's birthday, their gender, their grade level, their student number, and parent demographic information and contact information. These reports can be extremely useful if, say, you need to build a attendance report for a field trip. We could create a report including the student's names, their grade level, and say their gender. And we could include their emergency contact, their emergency contact's phone number, and their home phone number in the report. We can then select which students we want to run the report for and use the Add or Remove Students button and the checkboxes to select individual students. Finally, we can change the format of the report, making it landscape or portrait, determining its output type, turning off row shading, including top or bottom notes in bold or not, and including a signature line. Let's take a look at our report that we ran for our field trip. As we can see, we can see the grade, gender, and name of the students along with their contact information, their contact's emergency phone number, and the phone number for their home phone. These boxes would be populated in a real server using real data. Another thing that you can use the, in the student roster report for is creating a substitute attendance sheet. In this instance, you could simply sort students by last name, remove all columns except for the student's name, and include a signature line. With this report, we could request that our substitute mark attendance on the sheet so that we don't have to give them access to our PowerSchool courses and we could ask them to include a signature and a date to verify that the, that the attendance was taken. There are many other uses for the student roster report, and it's a highly versatile report that can show a wide range of data.